Before we start the video, let me give you a brief introduction about myself. I'm Chandresh Mahajan, who is founder and chief educator at Exergic, which is India's most trusted and comprehensive institute for online gate preparation. I got an All India Rank 37 from Gate Mechanical Engineering, and I am an ex Indian Oil Officer, having six plus years of teaching experience as of now. To know more about our Gate courses, you can contact us on these details. Also, you can download Exergic Gate Preparation app from Google Play Store. The link is available in the description of video. Now, the concepts of entropy as such are very simple, but the way they are presented confuses aspirants. In this short lesson, I am going to address, I am going to discuss one such concept Although I have told this concept to you already, but in this case, I am presenting that in the form of a short, a small numerical problem. Okay. And then some of you may get confused here and ultimately I will explain you the concept again and clear any confusion. Suppose you have an electrical resistor. This is the electrical resistor. Okay. What does it do when current passes through it? Due to the heating effect of current, since it, it provides a resistance to the flow of current, heat is generated, right? In this case, that resistor is open to the atmosphere. So whatever heat it is going to generate will be liberated, will be released, will be transferred to the atmosphere, to the ambient surrounding, correct? Suppose it has reached the steady state. When you start the current, it slowly starts to heat up, right? As it starts to heat up, it will start losing heat as well. But a time will come when the rate of heat generation will become equal to the rate of heat release. Because as it gets heated up, the temperature difference between the surrounding and the resistor, that also increases. And temperature difference is proportional to the rate of heat flow. This is a transfer, heat transfer concept. That is why a time comes when the rate with which heat is being generated because current is continuously flowing through it. So that rate becomes equal to the rate of heat rejected to the atmosphere. That is the steady state for this case. Whatever will be the temperature at that state will be the stable temperature. That will be the constant temperature after that. Okay. Now, during the steady state, when it has reached the steady state, I am asking you that what is going to be the change in entropy of the electrical resistor? Different types of questions can be framed from it. It can ask you the change in entropy of the universe, the change in entropy of atmosphere. I am just talking about that specific entropy change about which I want to clear your confusion. So tell me the change in entropy of the resistor. Suppose everything is given to you. You know the current, you know the resistance, you know the temperature and for any short duration T also you can assume on your own. Tell me the expression for the change in temperature, sorry, change in entropy of the resistor. One type of uh, students, some students, they say that that sir, since it is at, it, it has reached the steady state, the electrical resistor, it has reached the steady state, right? So all its properties are fixed now. Its properties are not changing. So its entropy also will not change. The change in entropy of the resistor, once it reached the steady state, will be zero. This is what some of the aspirants say. While others say that, how can it be zero? It is receiving work, electrical work. There is no entropy transfer linked to the work. If the electrical resistor is receiving some work, in this case it is receiving electrical work. So there is no entropy entered or entropy transferred by that work. But since it is losing heat, so with that heat it is losing the entropy. So, sir, entropy is falling. Entropy should decrease. Entropy can change in entropy will not be zero. There will be a change in entropy because it is not getting any entropy. 
but it is releasing the heat and with the heat entropy is decreasing for the electrical resistor this is another funda that some of the students believe in which of them is correct this one is correct change in entropy of this resistor electrical resistor or any such system which has reached the steady state is going to be zero there will not be any change in the entropy if this is true this one the second explanation that i gave is definitely incorrect now why it is incorrect some of you may think that it is very much logical if you have a system let us say this is our electrical resistor we are denoting it in the form of a system okay this is receiving electrical work so let's write w in whatever be the type of work with the w in no entropy is transferred right so for this case if i ask you entropy transfer this will be equal to zero but it is rejecting heat definitely right and entropy transfer as with q out is going to be there since it is at steady state let's say its temperature is t so at constant temperature it is rejecting q out what will be the entropy transfer minus q out divided by t for constant temperature we directly use q by t right or not so students think that sir entropy is not coming but it is leaving so entropy should decrease change in entropy should be something it will not be zero you have forgotten one very important part of entropy which is entropy generation entropy transfers entropy generates and then entropy leaves right transfers out it is transfer in it is transfer out so entropy generation you have not thought about what will be the value of entropy generation the heating effect of current means when the current flows heat is generated it is a irreversible process it is an irreversible process how because when current is flowing and heat is generated due to the resistance reverse cannot happen it can never happen that you have a electrical resistor and you started supplying heat to it rather than losing heat you started supplying heat to it so current will start flowing this is the total reverse process of what is happening right now right now current is flowing heat is rejecting you said that no now i will give the heat and now current should start flowing i am sure you know that this is not how things work right current is not going to flow like this it is never going to flow like this so this process is irreversible you cannot reverse everything and bring everything back to the initial state by reversing the process so obviously heat is going to entropy is going to generate into this process of internal heat generation what is happening heat is being generated internal to the resistor if this is the resistor heat is getting generated internally within the system heat is getting generated and that internal heat generation is going to generate the entropy because that is a reversible process correct how much will be the change in how much will be the generation of that entropy let us discuss that look if i apply the concept of steady state then i clearly know that whatever work is coming in same heat should move out then only it can stay in the steady state in the equilibrium otherwise its temperature will start rising or falling depending upon which one of them is more but since it is at constant temperature steady state both of them should be same and now answer me what should be the amount of heat generated because here heat is going to get generated what will be this amount of heat generated this will be equal to how much work is being done how much electrical work is being done same is generated as heat in an ideal resistor that's what we calculate i square rt right whatever power is supplied to the resistor it generates the same in the form of heat internally due to the heating effect of current 
so this w in is also equal to heat generated within the resistor entropy transferred is zero entropy is not transferred by the work but since it is an irreversible process whatever energy it is receiving as work same energy it will generate in the form of heat and that heat generation is irreversible process that is why the entropy will be generated due to this q gen and entropy generation will not be equal to zero and tell me now how much will be the entropy generation same question suppose i am asking you all data is given to you about the question everything what is needed temperature and work input everything is known i am asking you how much will be the entropy generated within the resistor how will you know that whatever work it is receiving same amount of heat it is generating at constant temperature so entropy generation linked with q gen will be equal to q gen divided by t right or not how much heat is it is generating at constant temperature whatever entropy change or entropy generation you have to find out you can apply q by t in order to find that for such simple cases of constant temperature so increase in entropy will be q gen divided by t why because entropy transferred zero entropy got generated it got plus by q gen divided by t and as the heat is released from the resistor here it is released from it that will fall that will decrease the entropy by q out divided by t and since q out is equal to q gen whatever was the increase in entropy here same entropy it is going to release as heat so what is going to be the total change in entropy of the electrical resistor zero whatever entropy was getting generated within the resistor it is releasing the same entropy out it is liberating it is releasing that in the form of q out since q gen and q out are same so what will be the total change in entropy zero the relation between heat input and entropy generation this is something which i have already told you in the lectures but this is something which you need to be careful about many aspirants they have an idea that work is getting in so no entropy there will be no entropy uh, you know transfer related with the work which is correct but you cannot say that for heat generation that is something internal to the system not related to the work transfer and for any such cases of steady state whatever energy is received as work same energy will be liberated will be generated as heat in some other type of problem also you can think about it maybe in the problem of pedal wheel work there is a system there is a fluid you are rotating the pedal wheel as a result of the work done to the pedal wheel the heat is generated within the system now some of you and you can frame a similar question based upon that now that is also irreversible you are supplying the work and as a result of that the temperature of the fluid increased which is around the pedal wheel can you do the reverse of it can you just supply the heat from the fluid to the pedal wheel work and it will start rotating on its own no that will not happen same funda you can apply there also so a number of such problems can be made where this concept will be used this is not a concept specific to electrical resistor in other problems also you can apply this concept and have don't have any confusion regarding the work and entropy generation all right